what's going on uh, YouTube as the title says Donnie Park the duck park well here we are man the famous park here where I live is called Donnie Park guys and this here's got it all for your uh, outdoor activities man so you could put a volleyball you can play volleyball over there they got the poles you just got to bring your own net and whatnot you got the updated uh, toy play area that uh, was uh, actually built by fathers kids everybody pinching in and you know uh, doing work and putting all that together so anyhow you got a brand new skate park over there that's about two years old I say brand new but it's about two years old three years old a lot of people like to go over there on their scooters and their skateboards and up and down this you know skate park We've got two restrooms main restaurant uh, one of the restrooms there one over there but what's the most interesting thing about this park is this large pond it goes way over there you know a lot of people just come here walk their dogs or walk you know boyfriend and girlfriend hand to hand just walk all around this huge old pond and they do got a lot of fish in here if you got bread right now or anything that you throw in the water that's like a food item you'll start seeing all these carps you'll start seeing seagulls come by to try to steal it from the fish then you'll see the ducks come the seagulls are actually battling with the ducks and the geese so the seagulls do dominate when you start feeding out here the seagulls will be picking up most of the food you only see one but when you start feeding they'll come out of the woodworks but yeah man this is a nice park guys look at that big old bird is that called a pelican got a big old beak huge I never seen that bird here I'm used to just seeing geese ducks fish and seagulls but now I'm actually seeing another addition is whatever the flamingo or no no pelican look like a pelican and these little things whatever they are they're a certain kind of duck breed I believe I don't like seeing spray pay can can in the water it's bad for the fish it's bad for the ducks and I just can't ignore it guys yeah that's not right Look at the trash was only a few feet away. Some people, I tell you. The only thing is about this park, man, that I really don't like. If you're thinking about coming, laying on the grass, that's <laughs> something that you ain't going to want to do. You see, all these here animals, they got to use the restroom, right? And believe me, it looks like green grass. looks like, yeah, you could go right there. But every square inch of this here park there's always doo-doo <laughs> yeah but uh, I do like this park a lot have a lot of memories here there's been a time guys see I used to live if I was on that side of the park there would be an alleyway that if you go up the alleyway it would lead you to my house that I once lived in so one time I came walking down the alleyway, came to the park, and uh, there was a big orange and gray and brown goose, and it followed me home, man. It walked with me side by side all the way home. I didn't have to, like, try to call it or nothing. And I was trying to not even have him follow me. I was like, Harry, right, you got to stay here. But he wasn't having it. So he actually went home, stood the night with me out there. He slept in the yard. I woke up the next morning, held the poop everywhere in my backyard. My family was like, hey, you got to take that thing back, man. I said, if it listens, I don't know if I can. They were like, well, take a bike with you. That way you could just ride off quick, you know. So I did. Grabbed me a little bicycle. Walked with the duck back. There was kids getting in the car, going to school. And they'd be like, mom, look. And she'd turn around, thinking it would be somebody walking the dog or something, and then she'd double look. And I said, oh my god, that guy is not walking a dog, he's walking a goose, <laughs> you know, without a leash even. But yeah, so I walked the goose back, and then I was like, hey man, we gotta depart. Sorry, this is where you gotta stay. And uh, 
I got on the bike, man. I took off and that goose flew, making all these noises. It just flew and flew and it stood at the edge of the park. And I just kept going, man. And that's the last time I ever seen that goose. Back in my mind, I was thinking, I hope he didn't be so friendly and follow somebody else home and maybe somebody. But I don't, I don't want to think like that. I was thinking somebody made a meal out of him or something, you know. But yeah, maybe somebody gave him a better home. But I don't see him here. There's, there's, he's very identifiable. All these geese are gray and what, but this here goose was orange and white and brown. But yeah, I wish him the best though. He was a good little buddy. It's a trip. Animals can feel if you're good, if you got good attention, you got a good heart. And I guess it trusts me, you know. Look at these goose, big old birds flying overhead. Not birds, but geese. Yeah, I'm going to end up taking off right now, but I just want to walk over here and see these little guys before I do take off. It says, please don't feed the ducks or the geese. That's why everybody comes here is to do that, just that. Let's see what these ducks are getting into. See them over here. I just don't want them to get into something that's not good for them like look there's bags what's in this bag orange pillings molded stuff throwing it away bags kill a lot of white uh what do you call it aquarium life animals you know fishes get in there can't get out, they die. Get wrapped around feet, beaks. I just don't like seeing stuff like that. So, so far what I threw away is that, that, and a bottle. <laughs> Feel like I did my good deed for today. All right guys, time to depart from this here park. Instead of just backing out and going right here to the road, I'm going to ride all the way to the end. Show you a little bit more of this here park. They <laughs> make it now right here. But yeah, here's this here uh, skate park I was talking about, guys. Brandon, I was in, uh, in memory of Brandon Knott. Or Koch, or I don't know how to pronounce that. But cool, man. Gives it a lot of kids around this here neighborhood something to do after they got their homework done and whatnot. <laughs> a lot of kids actually do uh, put their homework to last and come and play and play. But yeah, man, I do the same as a kid. But I, I would love to have a skate park when I was a kid. Not that I'm too much of a skater, but I think I would love to fiddle around on a skate on a skate ramp like that. On my bicycle, if not a little scooter, but on a skateboard, I don't know. I'm not too good on skateboards. Well, guys, this is it for Donnelly Park, the Duck Park. Awful roads right here. But it's a huge park, man. Oh, 
Oh, you know what? I gotta go to the store. Forgot about I need to go to the store. Well, guys, thank you for watching the Duck Park, the Donnelly Park, and um, remember to subscribe, like, and I'll see you on the next one. Thank you for watching.